It's early, but I want to get this video started. And the biggest question is, so there's a little yellow in here. Biggest question is, why am I video vlogging? Why am I choosing YouTube? Why do I want to record my daily life? Um, and the truth is, simple truth is, um, this woman right here yeah so i uh mainly because of my wife i wanted to start a start a vlog start uh a youtube channel um i was inspired by her she had been she she does this uh professionally so so what's this channel all about um right now i'm just making this because i love creating uh, whether it be a, a video or a painting or anything. Uh, on emails. Boop. Yes, that says 10,735 unanswered emails. A lot of those are spam. All right, emails are done and it's time to go and paint. Boop, boop, boop. So here I am mixing colors. Uh, I start with a quinacridone red, and then um, I use an orange, kind of like a fiery orange. And then I have some purple in there. I have a little bit of yellow and white. Um, and these are the colors I start off with. But first I start with an underpainting, which is that like raw umber color. And it's, it's just a watered down brown color. Uh, and then I go, I use either my dark tones and then work my way lighter and then switch back and forth. So I'll go from dark to light. And this is just the way I learn how to paint. Um, I'm a self-taught artist. Uh, I, I learned how to paint this way. Some people start off in the middle, like a mid-tone, and then they work their way uh, either backwards or forwards. Um, but I normally start like dark to light and then and then I work my way backwards and forwards. So here I am filling in the painting. Uh, I like to cover as much of the painting as I can. Uh, I don't really like to do one portion of the painting just by itself or stay in one area and then work my way down. I like to work all over the canvas. Sometimes I get asked what it is I'm thinking about whenever I am painting. And to be truthful, I'm not really thinking much at all. Um, a lot of times this just comes natural uh, from painting for many, many years. Uh, I can just pick up a paintbrush, start mixing some colors together and add it onto the canvas. And if I mess up, I just rework it and do it all over again. And I think for me, that's why, that's what really attracted me to painting was that I could make a mistake and just paint over it. This is where I start um, adding dimension and kind of depth to the painting, to the face. Uh, adding depth is pretty hard. You have to keep going back and forth and uh, it's 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 a lot of work. Um, here I am, I've kind of found the depth that I wanted. And so I'm adding just the highlights where the light hits the most. One of my favorite parts is just adding the hair. So here's the painting without the outline. 
I'm almost complete and I saved the funnest for last, which is the outline. The outline kind of ties everything together. Um, my favorite paint to use for outlining, especially in black, is uh, the Golden Liquid Acrylics. Um, that, to me, it's, it's a little bit pricey, but it's the best that I have found to outline things with. And so I use Golden a lot because of that. They, they just have good product. So um, yeah, here I am outlining. This is so much fun. Just seeing this ghost come together. <laughs> After one week of work, it is finally complete. Thank you for watching all the way to the end. If you could like, share, and subscribe, that'd be awesome. I have some new stuff coming out next week, so stay tuned. Peace.